Hello and welcome to the tutorial on Find the Missing Number. In this tutorial, we will learn how to find the missing number for numbers up to 100 and we're going to do this with addition questions. Now, you know the number grid method and in the previous tutorial, we worked on the subtraction method. We're now going to use a different method. So let's begin by writing the first question. We have something plus 59 equals 87. So 59, so sorry, something plus 59 equals 87. So what we're going to do in this method is add the number or increase the number from 59 until we get to 87. Okay, and we're going to start with the units. How many units have we got? Well, we've got nine units. How many units do we need to get to? Well, we need to get to, I'll write it down here, seven units. Now, nine plus what number gives us seven units? The next seven is 17. Okay, so what number do we have to add to nine to get to this 17? The answer is 8. 9 plus 8 equals 17. And because it's 17, there's a 10 there, we carry that across to the tens column. Okay, that's the units done. How about the tens? We've got how many tens do we have? Well, we don't have 5 because we carried one over. We've got 6. 5 plus 1 is 6. How many do we need to get to? Well, we need to get to 8. So 6 plus 2 equals 8. 6 plus 2 equals 8. And that is our answer, 28. So 28 plus 59 equals 87. How did we do that? Well, we started at 59, and first we added the units. We added 8 units, and we went from 59 plus 8. That gave us 67. Okay, there's the 6, 67. And then simply we had to add 20 to give us 87. Okay, it's a nice simple method. Now I'm going to use the same method, but we're going to work on our second example. This time we're going to do it slightly differently. This time we've got 74 plus something equals 96. So 74 plus something equals 96. So we're starting at number 74, and we're going to add numbers to this until we get to 96. Okay, so let's start with the units. We have four units. How many do we need to get to? Well, we need to get to six units. So what number do we need to add? We need to add two. And because we're adding two, the 74 now becomes 76. Okay, we're now on to the tens. How many tens have we got? Well, we've got seven. How many do we need to get to? We need to get to 9. So what number added to 7 is going to give us 9? The answer is 2. Okay. And 0 units to add. Okay. So we have now reached our number of 96. Just double check. Is it the same? Yes, it is. Now what numbers did we add? Well, we added the 2 here and the 20 here. And we simply just add the columns, two tens, two units. The answer is 22. Let's write that down. 74 plus 22 equals 96. 74 plus 22 equals 96. So it's simply adding on until we get to the number after the equal sign. So that is how we find the missing number for numbers up to 100 for addition questions.